Today I'm going to review another 3D printer made by my sponsor Creality 3D. This is the CR10S. I don't need to go into too much details because there are lots of other reviews on the net. It is a bit like my Ender 3 that I reviewed last time, but it has a larger uh, build area, a step up in print quality, so it is a little bit more expensive. But don't worry, I've got a discount code from my friend at Print Solid that I'm going to give away at the end of the video. So now let's unbox it and take a look. As always, very well packaged. Today I'm just going to build everything on the ground. They have some clips uh, that clip the glass printing bed on the top of the aluminum bed. This does not look like the PTFE2. I think it's the decoration uh, to fill in the gaps in between the aluminum. So put it aside. And here is the instruction. Instruction. Okay. Okay. Instruction in both Chinese and English. And it teaches you step by step to assemble the printer with all the drawings and all the parts. They illustrate the uh, parts in the chart. So it should be pretty uh, easy to understand and assemble it through the instructions step by step. And this is the power cable. Oh, a small spatula and two kits there are zip ties inside some allen keys wrench so basically they send you everything you need to assemble this printer and the spool holder USB cable and stop this is the PTFE2 and this is the USB, wait, is it USB or SD card? I think they put the SD card in the SD card holder. And another brackets and with a jack inside. And uh, this one is the spool holder. And they have uh, sample filaments. And this is the power supply. Ooh. So this is the frame of the 3D printer. It's a little bit heavy. Let's put it, everything in front of the box. Now we can move the box aside and start to assemble the printer. Let me take a look at the instruction first. Yay, more fresh cutter for me. I think this is the masking tape that helps to stick, um, helps the models to stick better on the heating bed. But now I'm not going to put this. I am going to do it later. I think I'm just going to print it on the glass bed. <laughs> Ta-da-da-da-da! 
So on both sides there are screw holes so it's very easy to spot them but this is a lot more straightforward than the other three I would say. It is bigger, yes, but also it is easier to assemble it. Okay, the power is on and the nozzle is hot, so now I'm going to feed in the filament. Now let's level the bed. Now I'm going to place a paper on the heated bed and they have a assisted bed leveling built in. It's not auto leveling but it will be pretty quick. Let's go to menu and select prepare and they have a bed level. So there are thumb screw underneath. I am going to turn it till I feel a snug. Okay, next. Right, it seems pretty neat, but I have to go through the procedure again to make sure it's level. So let's do it again. Okay, now let's try a test print. <laughs> Okay, we had a little bit of an adventure. Let me show you what the first print looks like. This is the first print. 
it looks pretty bad. So I found out a problem was that the Bowden 2 was kind of bent in shipping and it wasn't fitting in the connectors properly. So there was a spare one in the box. I took it out and I put it back on and this time I check it is locking the connectors firmly and it is sitting properly. And uh, this is what I got for the second print. And if I doubt it in, I think I will get a better result. This is, this is just the default setting I have. I'm pretty happy with the print quality for a second print, but I think I can tune it in a bit and get a better result. In the meantime, if you are thinking of getting one of the CR10S and if you're in the US, go check out my friends at Print Solid. Use the code Cyborg Discount. You'll get $25 off. They unbox, they unbox it and check everything. Make sure there are no issues before they ship it. So compared to other platforms, they offer a better service. And now I'm going to get to work on this. Remember, if I can do it, anyone can do it. Please subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching.